Hi friends, it's Angie and uh, we are being all sneaky. What's... Oh, I'm supposed to go that way. Okay. But obviously I'm not going to do it. At least not straight away. Turn on the curve conveyor belt. Okay. Because what? I'm not supposed to go this way? Oh, I'm not... I won't manage to go this way. I mean, I can try. But I bet... It will jump straight at me. It didn't. Okay. Scan to connect. A security camera. Let's try. Uh, oh, it's on the other side of the door. Okay, so I, I don't see anything. This guy will for sure jump me because I'm, I'll be right into his camera. Okay, he didn't jump me, but my heart is jumping out of my chest. Uh huh. Scan to connect. Okay, so I'll have to turn this camera some other way. But these doors aren't opening. There's something wrong with them. Anyway, okay. I think when the camera is like yellow and pointing down, it means it's disabled or something. Maybe. And what's in there? Oh, it's, uh, it's making another one. Another bot or something. Let's use this PC. Volkova Site 9 Recovery and Storage. Site 9 continues to be the focus of mission operations. The artifacts recovered have been invaluable. Icarus team reports unprecedented pr preservation of pieces that have been carbon dated to over 30,000 years old. 30, yes, 30,000 years old. Secrecy has been difficult to maintain, but no, no authorization has been given for Invictus team clearance. Created items by date, weight, and priority. Okay, so basically you are finding some stuff here on the planet. So for sure there was like some sort of intelligence. Water sources. Discovery of preserved ice vein beneath site during geothermal excavations. Resources diverted. Outside operations continue at reduced priority. Ulysses Patera. Samples return negligible. Ne ne negligible. Yes, low priority. Biblis Patera. Quietude 3 returned basal deposits promising increased activity due to micro microbial samples. Gaigas Sulci. Initial scan and sample analysis. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Uh, microbial samples. Biblis Patera. Basal samples from areas A16, A27 analyzed. Organic, mon mon uh, organic molecules discovered no fossilization, promising site. Basal samples from areas blah 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 analyzed. No signs. Basal samples, no signs. Basal sample, no signs. Basal sample from A71 analyzed. Microbe fossil discovered. Crystal formation report. C cyano cyanobacteria evidence of microbial life on Mars recommended action stand by to divert Invictus team after Cyrano uh, crew rel relief divert excavation efforts upon update from control okay and that's all and we need to power up this thing can I can I walk on this no is there any, any, activate conveyor belt? Maybe if I look through the glass somewhere? Like, no. Here, there isn't a window here. 
okay. Okay, it can see me, but can it open the door? Pfft, no, it can't. Okay, I can connect to this. But how can I connect? How can I power up the conveyor belt? Because that's my new... 31 meters over there. How do I do that, though? There isn't anything to do here. It's over there. There's the activation of the conveyor belt. Okay, maybe I missed something on the other side. So let's check that first. I came through here. This is this is the entrance that I came through. Okay, it shows me the way here. As you can see, the yellow path on the floor. And it shows me to go there, but the door is closed and I didn't see any any button, anything to open it. Should I, I don't know, use a... Pff, use, use a crowbar? I should still have it in my inventory. Can I? I can't move if I have something in my hand. I cannot... Unfortunately, I cannot channel my inner uh, Gordon Freeman. Wait. Right? Gordon. That was his name. It doesn't look like I can do anything here. Okay, I'm stumped for the first time. In a long time. Maybe I missed something here? In the computer? No. There are only logs here. I can't do anything with these things. I can't do anything here. I can I can step onto this, but I can't go step onto the, the boxes there or onto the conveyor. Like you could easily go around there, but <sighs> Okay, I can control the camera. Maybe maybe if I make the camera see me, the 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 robot will be pissed or something. Ah yes, I think so. Uh uh did I do the right thing? Was it was it correct? Was it correct course of action? Because now I'm concerned. Maybe... Wait, maybe I can control him. Maybe I can control him. Can I control you, Mr. Robot? Ro robot Roboto. Roboto. Hello? I'm here. I'm here. Hello. Can you like open this door? I know that then I'll have to like run away from you, but hey, hi, hello. No. Okay, but we are one step closer to something. Although I'd, I'd wait. Let's try again. Let's try again. See me. And uh, there's there was a window. Maybe I can see it through the window here. Hello? Because I remember seeing it when I was standing on that conveyor belt. But uh, I guess it goes only in a straight line. Like seriously, what, what, what do you want me to do, game? Because I clearly can't open this door. Let's try again with the crowbar but I can't do anything with the crowbar okay I think I'll have to like 
uh, look up the solution because I don't know. There's nothing else that I can interact with. And once I once I hack the camera and it see wait. Was I supposed to do that? And I need two two points. Uh says too much. So let's divert this and this yes that turned on the conveyor belt i should be able to get through the room next door if i head back wait how did how did i do okay oh no and now this is powered up well that sucks uh, no 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 not ma not me uh can you can you look like this and i'll just quickly run through here. Oh, okay. Okay, all right. And get to the other side, I think. I'm so happy. I didn't even need a solution. But then again, I don't know how I did that. There was this spider something, spider's web, whatever. So I guess it is possible to like switch between the controls or something. Okay, um, you, uh, boop, oh, and run. Uh, there might be a terminal that can unlock this in the conveyor belt room. Oh, now you're telling me. Oh, Jesus. Yee, in the conveyor belt room. Uh-huh. Oh, there is a computer. Wait, 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 did it see me? Oh, I think it saw me. Oh, 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 yes, it did. Oh, yes. ah, Jesus. No, go away. Leave me alone. Ouch. Okay, okay, okay. Where is it? Ah. 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 The. Yeah, restart from the last checkpoint. At least now I know what to do. You know what the problem is with the with the bad guys here? Um, because you know the, the same the same issue I had previously that uh, this this uh, strange manifestation was catching me and uh... oh wait I think I can con connect to other things when camera sees them okay um that turned on the conveyor belt anyway I what, what I wanted to say right. is that the problem I have with monsters here is um if they see you, they attack, but then they don't move away, but they stay in place. And because you are like, for example, clipping through something or like you are blocked on something, then you can't run away. So it instantly attacks you and it doesn't make any difference if it's like hurting you once or if it kills you instantly. It, it either way it kills me it, it kills me just basically there's no there's no other other option it will just make me dead while for example in soma if a monster attacked you you then were i don't know hurt but the monster traveled somewhere else. Like here, it could be, for example, that you are losing consciousness for like a second. The robot decides, okay, that's enough, and it goes back to its station. So when you wake up, it's not an immediate threat. You know what I mean, right? Anyway, let's, oh Jesus, wrong button, sorry. 
Um, message from Manticore, security level four. Automated message. This message is displayed in the event of catastrophic system failure or attack on this facility by an unknown, possibly transdimensional entity. If you are reading this, all doors are locked and sensitive materials protected by blast shielding due to heightened security measures. This extra security is an effort to protect any sensitive information from being collected and also from you. Please be aware that NDK13 advanced bipedal Android models are de designed for excavation and transport functionality and thus have the internal hydraulic capacity to ambulate and carry over 1000 kilograms. While an admittedly while an admittedly impressive engineering feat during a level 4 threat their their primary logic function is overridden and they will employ lethal force as needed to avoid injury or death seek out the nearest manticore approved panic shelter there are currently ze zero shelter facilities in your area <laughs> Security alert. Warning. Level 4 security protocol. All, all personnel access restricted. Z pathogen detected. Emergency protocol enacted. Containment procedures activated. Overseer console override required. Disable security. Okay. Security disabled. Does that mean this guy is disabled? Yeah. Although you weren't much of a... Much of a... <gasps> I am concerned that there is something. Okay, the light works funny here. Like clearly there's something wrong. Must be Volkova's lab. <laughs> I'm not loving it, you know. So, does that mean that he's Things came smells like gasoline and fertilizer. It's completely wrecked. Gasoline. Is that a frog? Oh, poor baby. Is that a spine? <laughs> I don't want to be here. Ah, <laughs> uh. oh, so many logs. Okay, log one. I begin the rhizophora DNA. I begin with rhizophora DNA. The possibility of creating decades worth of mangrove tree root networks within days or even hours, and the ability to control their patterns. One could weave a root network that would protect whole eroding coastlines from waves and storms. Today, I make my first introduction between rhizophora and Z path. It's the first time I've smiled in a long time. The warmth burns my cheeks. I mean, if you weren't such a horrible person, I might have found that adorable. Progress is exponential. With access to real equipment, keeping my exclusions minimal to preserve secrecy is a necessary evil. I suppose Dr. Van Buren continues to assist in the greenhouse. He may be suspicious of my sudden focus on plant growth formulae, but he remains preoccupied with protocols and failsafes. The places Z-Path can take us are boundless. I believe it is the key to reaching a place where we can swap sequences of prokaryotic cells, bacteria, and eukaryotic cells plant slash animal, as freely as weaver splices thread on a loom. As the rhizophora feeds, the z-path grows more comfortable. I recognize the improper terminology, but it is clear. Its movements are less erratic. It breathes calmly, slowly. The roots expand at a constant rate. The leaves extend and reflect. The leaves extend and flex. Reactions to magnetic pulses are less severe. The meta metamorphosis is fascinating. Today I moved my hand. I reached out for an instrument that wasn't within my reach. I'm unsure as to why. There was no scientific impulse or protocol for it. Possibly sleep de deprivation. I reached to pick up a laser diode five feet away as naturally as it 
as if it were in my back pocket, but it wasn't. My hand, but it wasn't my hand that grasped the instrument. It was the Z-path. Two thin tendrils extended outwards from the valerian blossom to scoop it up. The tendrils swiftly curved and extended through the air, then deposited the diode in my hand and retreated. The valerian, unable to extend as quickly, altered its stem structure, growing a thin vine-like piece which dro drooped to the counter as the tendrils receded again. I will attempt this experiment again tomorrow once I have rested. Even my sens sensibilities have limits and I question whether I dreamed the entire event. Yes. The infected mice, the enlightened specimen, the Z-Path, makes them grow stronger. Just like the mangrove tree, they voraciously search for food. Their forms surprisingly similar, less chaotic than the others. The protuber... Uh, protuberances extend outward from their mouths. Their ligaments con contort beneath their skin as they stand by petal. Am I creating them? They resemble sunflowers, seed-like teeth and slithering petals. They crave my affection, demand my attention like children, like pets. Did they snarl at Lucas when he kissed me? Not in front of the kids, I said. But are they not my children? Are they not all my children? The, re <laughs> the Rhizophora, the Valerian, Solanum Lycopersicum, Amophilia Brevoligulata, Mus Musculus, they have all shared in my blood, sucked the sweat from the tips of my fingers. I tell them how to grow and they stretch outward to the infinite. The connection is undeniable. Wait, Lucas kissed her or tried to kiss her? I mean, he mentioned in his, um, in his diaries, let's say, logs, that he admires Volkova, but I would say that he's taking it a, a step further. Betrayal! The Z-Path spoke to me today, not in words, but I felt it as it moved along the walls of Argus. I could taste the metal on my tongue as, I, as it slithered into the cracks between the seams. I told it to stop and it obeyed, patiently waiting for me to descend in the elevator. My daughter was excited to see me. I wanted to, It wanted to show me something. A computer monitor flashed and I saw Dr. Van Buren standing over the roots of the mangrove, injecting a serum into it. My body shud sh shud shuddered as the Z-Path trembled. How could he betray us like this? We will make him suffer for it, for this. She grows so fast, Rizophora, my child. She was so, so hungry today. The blood meal was not enough. Her teeth are so sharp against the flesh of my breast. I nursed her for an hour. My head swims. Ew. A new project. I've made my decision. I can't understand why I hesitated so long. Why did I allow them to control me? I will escape this prison. Orochi seeks to contain me. Lucas destroys my children. The walls themselves betray me, moving closer, stifling my work. This frail human body betrays me, tired, sleepless. The muscles ache and twist, Cir circulatory and nervous systems trembling so I can feel my heartbeat shuddering. My plants feel the vibrations, vibrations that travel on vectors our feeble senses have yet to discover, have yet to even discover. They call out to me, my children. It has already begun. My child, I touched its hand and the blackness encircled my wrist. The Z-pad swirled into my system and it speaks to me in tones. It beckons me to the mangrove tree and there we will embrace. Together we will remove all impediments. The work will be glorious. All right. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess she had a passion for this. Anyway, I think this is a good place to uh, take a break because we've been we've been doing this for uh, for quite a long moment. Anyway, 
I need to I need to work through this. This is this is a lot of information. We are learning a lot of stuff about not only the stuff that's happening here, like these experiments, but also like connections between people. Anyway, for now, that's enough. Ah, thank you so much for being here with me and for watching. And I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.